Hello and welcome to This Month at the Libraries. I'm your host, Mark Murray. Welcome to March, the end of winter and the beginning of spring. As you know, the Lower Marion Libraries are still offering services throughout this pandemic. We're continuing to monitor the status of the COVID-19 situation and its impact on the libraries. And we'll continue to follow the recommendations of the Commonwealth of Libraries and the county and state health departments. The libraries are working hard to bring you the highest level of service possible in this ever-changing environment. The Lower Marion Library System is here to help you get through this troubling time with thousands of books, movies, CDs, pre-recorded books for you to enjoy. Each of the six libraries is here with a huge amount of fun activities and programs for you and your family. Contactless pickup is available. Patrons may place holds on material. When you're notified the items are in, call the library and select the day and time for pickup. Online programs will continue and the libraries will be offering grab and go bags for children. Please wear a mask when picking up items. Telephone support is available. So call to ask reference questions, place holds, or request a selection of books catered to your interests. Check out our downloadable services like Overdrive, Hoopla, and Canopy. Canopy streams critically acclaimed movies, inspiring documentaries, award-winning films, and so much more. Check it out on our website. Click on the Canopy logo. Be sure to have your Lower Mary Library card on hand so you can sign in. Wi-Fi is available in all the parking lots of the libraries using the Stop and Go network. Now, please be aware, face masks are required for all in-person library programs. We've got a lot to cover. Before I get started, I want to remind you to mark your calendars in April because all the Lower Marion libraries will be closed on Friday, April 15th and Sunday, April 17th in observation of Easter. Let's get started. Let's see what the Ardmore Library has coming up in March. The Ardmore Library is located at 108 Ardmore Avenue in Ardmore, Pennsylvania. Their current operating hours may vary due to the pandemic, so check out their hours at lmls.org. Teen Dungeons and Dragons game. Learn to play Dungeons and Dragons, the fifth edition. It's a great intro to role-playing games and a chance to practice math, problem solving, and teamwork while having fun. Continued attendance is encouraged. Please register. Miss Donita's story time will be on Thursdays at 1 p.m. in person and via Zoom. Hear an entertaining story. Limited in-person attendance, advanced registration, and social distancing is required. A concurrent Zoom session will be available. On March 3rd, National I Want to Be Happy Day. On March 10th, National Hug Your Dog Day. On March 17th, St. Patrick's Day and absolutely incredible. March 24th, Tree Story Time. March 31st, National Crayon Day. Teen Code Club will meet Thursdays at 4 p.m. for ages 13 and up. Learn to code and practice math, problem solving, and teamwork while having fun. Join our Prenda Code Club at lmls.org. Activities include self-guided learning and projects using Prenda, turning tumble kits, and other code-related activities. Continue attendance is encouraged and registration is required. Music Playgroup will be on Wednesdays at 11.30 a.m. in person, inside, and also on Zoom. Ages are preschool and younger. Learn to make music with songs and simple instruments. This is a 30-minute program. Space is limited and weekly registration is required. And you can register to be on Zoom. State Representative Greg Vitale's satellite office is located in the Ardmore Library. The office is open on Thursdays from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. in the small conference room located downstairs in our program and book sales room. It is handicap accessible via the elevator located next to the circulation desk. If you have any questions, please call the office at 610-789-3900. First Wednesday Book Club. Our First Wednesday Book Club currently meets in the Processing Center Meeting Room, which is the building behind the library, and over Zoom. New members are always welcome. To join, please email Ruth Berman at drberman at horizon.net. On March 2nd at 11.30 a.m., they'll discuss Washington Black. On April 6th at 11.30 a.m., they'll discuss Just Mercy. Fold and Fly will be on Mondays, March 7th to April 25th at 4.30 p.m. via Zoom. This is for ages five and up. Registration is required a week in advance. Learn to make paper airplanes and what makes them fly. Paper and necessary designs will be distributed via a grab-and-go bag in our main entrance every Monday starting March 7th. 
We're planning to run this activity for four to eight weeks. Consistent attendance is not necessary, though registration is required for each week, and the bags are limited. Zoom links will be sent out via email to the registered participants. We planted a tree with Miss Hillary. We'll be on March 12th at 2 p.m., outside weather permitting or on Zoom. All ages are welcome. Registration is required. Let's read about trees and then get creative and design our own magical tree that can grow anywhere we want. This is part of a Longwood Gardens Community Read Program. We planted a tree with Miss Donita. We'll be on March 26th at 2 p.m. This will be an in-library program for ages five and up. Registration is required. Join us in learning about trees and how they help protect the land. A science experiment will be shown and special seeds from Longwood Gardens will be provided as a take home. This is part of a Longwood Gardens Community Read Program. The Armour Library offers great programs even during a pandemic. Now, don't forget, you can check out all of the Armour Library's programs and events on the library's website at lmls.org. You can also stay up to date with the Armour Library by checking out their Facebook page and following them on Twitter. Now, let's see what the Ballad Kinwood Library has coming up this March. The Ballad Kinwood Library is located at 131 Old Lancaster Road in Ballad Kinwood, Pennsylvania. Their current operating hours may vary due to the pandemic, so check out their hours online at lmls.org. Storytime Mondays and Tuesdays will be at 10.30 a.m. in person. Space is very limited, so registration online is required. Masks are required for participants aged 3 and up. Learn about Spectacular Women Scientists on March 9th at 7 p.m. This is an in-library event. Femi Palmer will present an interactive program about the lives of Dr. Patricia Bath, a scientist who overcame racism and poverty while developing a treatment for blindness, and Dr. Maya Jameson, the first black female astronaut. Participants will conduct simple experiments. Registration online today, please, the space is limited. This is appropriate for ages five to seven, and masks are required for all participants. Garden Myths Busted with biologist and landscape designer Orsi Lars will be held on March 15th at 7.30 p.m. Don't let superstition waste your time and harm your plants. Gardening tips are often passed from gardener to gardener. And now, aided by technology, science is constantly changing. How can we make sure we're following good advice? Learn about common misconceptions and what you can do instead. Registration is required. Longwood Garden Community Read Program and Kids Art will be held on March 20th at 1 p.m. This is an in-library event. Holly Mead from Kids Art will conduct a fun art class based on the book, We Planted a Tree. Online registration is required. Space is limited. All participants must wear a mask. This is appropriate for ages seven to 10. Take and Make Craft will be held on March 28th to April 1st. Patrons three and up are welcome to stop by the junior room for a Take and Make Craft Kit. Please get there while supplies last. First Friday STEM will be held on April 1st at 1 p.m. via Facebook. The Junior Room staff explores fun STEM-based activities. Those who register online will receive a take and make bag with supplies to join in an activity. Once registered, stop by the library to pick up your bag the week of the event. The program link will be posted on Friday at 1 p.m. on Facebook and will be made available for viewing thereafter at lmls.org. Supplies are limited, so register today. This is appropriate for ages 8 to 12. We have to take a break, but stick around. We've got a lot more exciting programs and library fun coming your way, so don't go away. Hello and welcome back to This Month at the Library. I'm your host, Mark Murray. Hello, March. As you know, all the Lower Main Libraries are still offering services during this pandemic, and we're continuing to monitor the status of the COVID-19 situation and its impact on the libraries. And we'll continue to follow the recommendations of the Office of Commonwealth of Libraries, the county and state health departments. Now, the libraries are working hard to bring you the highest level of service possible in this ever-changing environment. The Lower Merion Library System is here to help you get through this troubling time with thousands of books, movies, CDs, pre-recorded books for you to enjoy. Each of the six libraries is here with a huge amount of fun activities and programs for you and your family. Contactless pickup is available. 
Patrons may place holds on material. When you're notified the items are in, call the library and select the day and time for pickup. Online programs will continue and the libraries will be offering grab and go bags for children. Please wear a mask when picking up items. Telephone support is available, so call to ask reference questions, place holds, or request a selection of books catered to your interests. Check out our downloadable services like Overdrive, Hoopla, and Canopy. Canopy streams critically acclaimed movies, inspiring documentaries, award-winning films, and so much more. Check it out on our website. Click on the Canopy logo. Be sure to have your Lower Marion Library card on hand so you can sign in. Wi-Fi is available in all the parking lots of the libraries using the Stop and Go network. Now, please be aware, face masks are required for all in-person library programs. We've got a lot to cover, but before we get started, I want to remind you to mark your calendars for April. All the Lower Marion libraries will be closed on Friday, April 15th and Sunday, April 17th in observation of Easter. Now, let's see what the Belmont Hills Library has coming up this March. The Belmont Hills Library is located at 120 Mary Watersford Road in Ballakinwood, Pennsylvania. Their current operating hours may vary due to the pandemic, so check out their hours at the LMLS website. Miss Gwen's Storytime will be on Tuesdays at 10.30 on the front lawn, weather permitting. Geared to toddlers, but all ages are welcome. If it's raining and there's no thunder or snow on the ground, we'll meet at the Playground Pavilion. Bring a beach towel or a chair. Leprechaun Scavenger Hunt will be held all month during March. Try to find a hidden leprechaun in the library. Seven different items listed on the Scavenger Hunt worksheet. Find all eight and win a small prize. Young Adult Crafting Teens and Tweens will be held on Facebook at 4.30 p.m. on March 14th. Take a break from school and enjoy creative time in this monthly program in conjunction with Longman Gardens Community Read Program. Registration is required at lmls.org to receive a take-home bag. St. Patrick's Day Storytime and Craft will be held on Facebook at 11 a.m. on March 12th. This is geared to ages 1 to 6, but all are welcome. Celebrate the luck of the Irish with a special story and craft with Mr. McEvan. Registration at lmls.org is required to receive a take-home bag. Longwood Gardens Community Read Raffle will be held on March 16th to April 20th. This year's Community Read theme is Trees, Nature's Great Connectors, and we'll be raffling off three prizes to celebrate. Each prize will include one of three Community Read books, a coupon for entrance for up to four people to Longwood Gardens, and a special treat. Prizes will be on display at the library, so come on in and check them out. There's no Blarney here on March 17th. Come to this all-day event. Decorate a shamrock and take home some Irish luck with you today. Materials will be available on the tables in the children's area. This is available for all ages. Welcome Spring. Story time and activity will be held on Facebook at 11 a.m. on March 19th in conjunction with Longwood Gardens Community Read Program with the theme of trees. We'll welcome Spring and our feathered friends back with a bird feeder that you can hang in your tree. Registration at lmls.org is required to receive a take-home bag. For more information on any of the Belmont Hills Library's programs, check out their webpage at lmls.org. Now let's see what's going on at the Gladwin Library this March. The Gladwin Library is located at 362 Writers Mill Road in Gladwin, Pennsylvania. Their current operating hours may vary due to the pandemic, so check out their hours at lmls.org. Toddler Storytime will be held on Mondays at 10.30 a.m. Due to COVID, it's still not determined whether we'll have story time virtually or in person. Registrants will receive an email updating the regarding status. The American Civil War lecture series, Sons of Aaron, who played a major role in the American Civil War, will be held on March 7th at 7 p.m. in person and via Zoom by historical reenactor and lecturer Michael Chessberger. The American Civil War is Ireland's forgotten conflict. In 1860, about 1.5 million Irish were living in the United States. During the American Civil War, some 150,000 Irishmen fought in the Union Army and about 20,000 joined and fought with the Confederacy. Although there are no exact figures of the Irish soldiers who died, it most likely ran into the thousands. Learn about the contributions and experiences of Irish soldiers. Learn when women lost the vote on March 14th at 7 p.m. via Zoom. Learn the little known history of the nation's first women voters and examine the political conflict that led to their voting rights being stripped away in 1807. 
This experience includes a virtual peek at the American Revolution Museum's online exhibit. This program is a virtual event and will be held on Zoom. Join our film discussion group on March 16th and 30th at 7 p.m. via Zoom. Discussions take place bi-weekly. Meetings are open to the public. Contact the library to join. The lecture, The Root of All Evil, Greed, Murder, and Life Insurance Swindles in the Greater Philadelphia Area will be held on March 21st at 7 p.m. via Zoom. In 1872, Winfield Gross was thought to have died in a fire in Baltimore and was buried. In 1873, his body was found, again, in a cornfield in Jennersville, Pennsylvania, riddled with stab wounds. The investigation into his death would reveal a ghastly life insurance fraud that went horribly wrong. This presentation will examine some of the worst cases of murder for life insurance in southeastern Pennsylvania. The Arts and Crafts Show will be held on March 21st to 26th. The Gladwin Library League's annual Arts and Crafts Show is back. Bring your original artwork, photography, needlework, jewelry, and other crafts ready to hang and be put on display. The opening night preview party will be on March 21st from 7 to 9 p.m. Be sure to check the library's website for the latest information. Come see Liberty, Don Cioni's paintings on March 24th at 7 p.m. via Zoom. The first major exhibit of Cioni's original work, Liberty plunges visitors into the most pivotal events of the Americans who fought for independence and reveal Cioni's research-based artistic process. The exhibit pairs Cioni's paintings with 18th century artifacts to bring to life the compelling stories about the diverse people and the complex events of the American Revolution. This program will be held on Zoom. Winter Spring Book Discussion Series, The Girls in the English Countryside, Middle March in a Lighter Vein, will be held on March 28th when they will review The Country Life by Rachel Cusk. Ruth Adelick will lead the discussion. The series takes place over Zoom. Participants must register through the Gladwin Library or give the library a call at 610-642-3957. To stay up to date with what's going on, check out their LMLS webpage and visit them on Facebook as well. Well, we've got to take a break, but we've got a lot more library fun heading your way, so stay tuned. Welcome back to This Month at the Library. I'm your host, Mark Murray. The Lower Marion Libraries are certainly so much more than just books. Check out our downloadable services like Overdrive, Hoopla, and Canopy. Canopy streams critically acclaimed movies, inspiring documentaries, award-winning films, and so much more. Check it out on our website. Click on the Canopy logo. Be sure to have your Lower Marion Library card on hand so you can sign in. The Lower Marion Libraries have it all. Well, we've got a lot to cover, but before we get started, I want to remind you to mark your calendars for April. All the Lower Marion Libraries will be closed on Friday, April 15th, and Sunday, April 17th, in observation of Easter. Now, let's see what's going on at the Ludington Library this March. The Ludington Library is located at 5 South Bryn Mawr Avenue in Bryn Mawr, Pennsylvania. Their current operating hours may vary due to the pandemic, so check out their hours online at lmls.org. Join Chair Yoga with Sinclair Brown on Wednesdays at 10 a.m., a one-hour recurring program containing chair yoga poses and breath work. Please register at lmls.org. Teen Craft with Liz Jackie will be held on March 2nd at 9 a.m. via Facebook. Create a fun vision board for Teen Mental Awareness Day. Virtual visit with author Keen Patrick Burke will be held on March 4th at 7 p.m. online, so please register online as well. STEM with Miss Ashley will be held on March 4th and 18th and April 1st and 22nd at 9 a.m. via Facebook. Miss Ashley has fun experiments for you to try. Storytime with Mr. Laurent will be held every Monday in March and April at 10 a.m. via Facebook Live. Registration is not required. Try It Out with Miss Melody will be held on March 8th and 22nd at 9 a.m. via Facebook. Miss Melody has something new for you to try today. Board Games for Grown-Ups will be held on March 8th from 5.30 to 8.30 p.m. Ludington Library is hosting Board Games for Grown-Ups in the large meeting room on the main floor. Library staff will be teaching games currently in the library's collection. 
But as always, you are more than welcome and encouraged to bring any game you're willing to teach and play. Ludington, making Medicare easy, understanding your Medicare choices will be held on March 9th from 12 to 1.30 p.m. In this seminar, participants will become familiar with how pre-existing conditions impact enrollment into supplement plans. Why supplement plans differ in cost despite offering identical coverage. Identifying the difference among supplement plans F, G, and N, and which plans are most suitable for you. And how an open enrollment period works and what benefits are you eligible for. Our time with Mr. Laurent will be held on March 11th and 25th at 9 a.m. via Facebook. Come and complete a fun art project with Mr. Laurent. Family Trivia Night will be held on March 19th at 8 p.m. on Facebook Live. Join Miss Casey and Miss Jackie for another great family trivia night. Create teams at home or challenge your friends online. Virtual board game tournaments will be held on March 20th from 6 to 8 p.m. online. Test your skills at Seven Wonders Duel. We'll be hosting a virtual board game tournament. Check out our online calendar for select games, registration, and how to play guides, and an introduction to Board Game Arena. We'll play Swiss-style tournaments where participants are grouped together with similar experiences and are guaranteed three matches. The games selected are simple and easy to learn. Ludington's Film Club will meet on March 29th at 7 p.m. The Ludington Library, in partnership with Viva Video, is offering a film discussion group. The group is free and geared toward adults with a passion for film. Be sure to check out all of Ludington Library's great programs online at lmls.org. Now let's see what the Penland Library has coming up in March. The Penland Library is located at 130 Overbrook Parkway in Wynwood, Pennsylvania. Their current operating hours may vary due to the pandemic, so check out their hours online at lmls.org. Pajama Storytime will be on Mondays at 7 p.m. via Facebook. Grab your snuggle buddy and join Miss Danielle for a story and a song before bed. This loot is for grades 6 to 12. Having trouble finding your next book to read? Do you like free stuff? Fill out our Lit Loot questionnaire and we'll pick three books for you. You'll get some fun, free swag as well. Please see us on our Facebook page for more information. Nature Corner. Did you know that Miss Danielle is a certified Pennsylvania master naturalist? Every week, there will be a table dedicated to the natural world where you can learn about frogs, owls, butterflies, and other outdoor wonders. Itty Bitty Book Club will be held on March 7th at 6 p.m. This is for grades kindergarten through second. Join Miss Danielle every month to read a story and do a craft. Registration is required. Elephant and Picky Day will be held on March 9th. It's everyone's favorite duo, so join us for crafts and games. STEM Club will be held on March 14th at 6 p.m. This is for grades three and up. Try paper circuits, Bristol bots, and more. Registration is required. Meets monthly and in person. If participants are under 10 years old, a parent or guardian must stay in the building during the program. Spring Take and Make will be held on March 21st. Celebrate the arrival of spring with a craft kit while supplies last. Exploding Kittens Game Club will be held on March 21st at 6 p.m. This is for grades three and up. Play the popular card game Exploding Kittens. Registration is required. Graphic Novel Club will meet on March 28th at 6 p.m. This is for grades three through five. Like graphic novels? Join Miss Danielle to discuss graphic novels and make one of your own. Registration is required. The Longwood Gardens Community Read Event will be held at the Penwin Park on March 30th at 12 p.m. Rain date will be April 1st. Get ready for the sixth annual Peeps Contest. Drop off your dioramas by Monday, April 18th. Voting will take place from April 19th through the 23rd. Work alone or with other Peeps. Create a diorama using Peeps and your imagination. See our Facebook or website for further details. Well, that wraps it up for this month. But before we go, I want to remind you to mark your calendars for April. Lower Marion Libraries will be closed on Friday, April 15th and Sunday, April 17th in observation of Easter. Also, our libraries are always looking for volunteers to help out. And so are we here at LMTV. If you'd like to try your hand at TV, not just on camera, but behind the scenes as a writer, an artist, editor, a camera person, just let us know. Email us at lmtv at lowermarion.org. 
I'm Mark Murray. And for the entire This Month team, thanks for watching. I'll see you next month.